card opening video here on Getaway Day Cards. As always, I am Mason. Today we have another mail day from Vamp Breakers. Uh, I have a couple more of these left, and then I think I'm probably done getting into some breaks for a little bit. Um, but we'll see if we can get some other content up on the uh, uh, channel here. But yeah, this is a couple weeks worth of breaks, I believe, because uh, the main guy that does the shipping went on vacation. So it took them a while to get everything out. Um, I'm trying to do this so I don't dox myself like I did last time. But we'll just get creative with sticky notes. There we go. All right. So I do not remember what all was in this break, to be honest with you. So we're just going to kind of go for it. Um, looks like I had the St. Louis Cardinals and maybe some other stuff. Uh, there's a slab. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. So I've got a couple different teams in here. So I've got the Baltimore Orioles, I've got the Colorado Rockies, and I've got the St. Louis Cardinals. So let's start with some of the non Cardinal stuff. Um, actually, these are all top loaded. So let's go to this. One. So there was quite a bit of product uh, in these breaks. We had some Bowman Sterling. We had some uh, Bowman Sapphire. We had some more. Um, oh, let's see. What else did we have? Tops Tribute. We had Gold Label. So we'll start right here at the top and do this little team bag of we've got a Juan Yepes rookie for Bowman Sterling. See if I can get that to focus because that is there we go. There we go. Juan Yepes from Bowman Sterling. We have a class two Yadier Molina. Uh and a class one Yadier Molina. I'm not a hundred percent sure. It looks like the difference is in the background. So like this one's got almost like a diamond plate design. Um this one is white and it's got a slightly different design. We do have some 2023 base. Nothing thrilling there. Um, then we get to some Topps Tribute. And we've got an Ozzy Smith. We also have some more Topps Gold Label. Uh, a couple different players or a couple different teams here so gold label from the cardinals this is actually a class three all goldschmidt we have a class one cal ripkin jr we have two cards in this one so we have a class two chris bryant and a brian servin from 2023 tops this one's back in its top loader here. Or penny sleeve, sorry. Top loader. Uh, we've also got some Panini Elite Extra Edition. Uh, a, I believe this is a silver of Sterling Thompson. We have a Topps Tribute from 2021 of Nolan Arenado and his Rockies Uni. Which you guys know me, I am a huge Nolan Arenado fan. So very happy to have that, uh, even though he is not in his Cardinals uni. Uh, we've got a Herman Marquez from uh, Chrome Sapphire. Uh, and then these are some pretty good ones. So I'm actually going to hold up on those. Let's see what's in this bag. And then I will reveal what's behind there. So we've got some more numbered cards coming up. We've got... Um, I don't even remember who that was. Okay. Yeah. So Ryan Mountcastle, rookie from uh, 2021 Bowman Chrome Sapphire. We have an Andres Galarraga auto out of Topps Tribute, numbered 122 of 199. I was not expecting to get an auto in that break. I, I actually bought in with the Rockies specifically to spite somebody because they were talking about how anytime they're in a break with me 
I just get all these hits and don't leave any for anyone else. So I was being spiteful, got in with the Rockies, and ended up hitting an Andres Galarraga auto, a Gabriel Hughes um, patch, and a Ryan Valady Chrome Sapphire number 2450. So he, it, it, on top of the Nolan Arenado from Tribute. So he was a bit frustrated with me because I ended up going in and and hitting pretty big in that. And that's not the only thing that I got in that one either. Um, as I do have one other card here that I'm going to show you in a minute. Uh, however, let's move over to the three other hits in the pile that I've already showed you. So under the Herman Marquez, we have kind of a cool one for me. This is the first round gems. Cooper Jerpy, one of one from Leaf Metal. So if that will focus, there we go. One of one right there. So yeah, that was cool. This is a really sick looking card. Uh, so I ended up getting both a Cooper Jerpy and an Alec Burleson one of one out of this product. Um, so I'm very happy with that. Then at a Bowman Sterling, which is a big rookies and prospects product. I hit a card that I did not even kind of think was going to happen. I got an Albert Pujols numbered 48 of 50. And not only that, it's a clear acetate card. Which is freaking cool. So I was very, very excited to get that. Um, this is from the 2022 Bowman Sterling set. And that's just an awesome, awesome card. And then out of that same break, out of 2022, uh, I think this is Raft. No, this is from uh, 2022 Bowman Sapphire, Joshua Baez first Bowman. So I'm a big Josh Baez guy. Really like him as a prospect. I think he'll be really good. So I was excited to get that. Um, but yeah, I think that Albert was probably the big one there. Um, let's see. So now we've got two cards left and the break that I got the Rockies, I, or not the Rockies, the break that I got the Orioles, I was really hoping that I would get some pretty big hits because there were some products in there that would have like some big Adleys, some big Gunners, um, stuff like that. Didn't end up getting lucky and getting anything like that. However, I did still manage to get a hit. Before I show you those, I'm going to show you the stickers that they sent. I have no idea who this is. It appears to be some anime character, but then we also have the uh, Iron Man uh, Infinity Gauntlet with I am Iron Man inscribed on it there. Um. But yeah, so our last two hits uh, in the Orioles uh, break, I ended up getting a Dean Kremer, uh, 9 out of 35 from Tops. I think it's Triple Threads, right? Yeah, Triple Threads. Also, every other card that I said was Tribute, it was definitely not Tribute. It was definitely Triple Threads, and I just completely misspoke. Um yeah, so a Dean Kremer triple patch. The black has a little bit of the um, the uh, oh, what do you call it? The stitching there, the white stitching. Um, and then in the Rockies break that I got in just for spite, this was the biggest hit out of it. So in 2021 Onyx Gems, they had an encased card in every box. And one of the encased cards just so happened to be an uncirculated autograph of Zach Veen um, that was authenticated by CSG and slabbed. And that is a really nice looking card. So uh, that purple is numbered to 10. Oh, that's not purple. That's red. Ruby. That is Ruby. I'm just dumb. Um, 
So I don't think that's a numbered one then. I'll, I'll have to look into that because I'm confused about the whole ruby and red. Like, is this numbered to 40 or is this not numbered to 40? So uh, we will see. Oh, that's on the ink. Okay, so it's blue ink. So it's numbered to 100. There we go. That, uh, that makes sense. It is the ink color that determines it. Blue is numbered to 100. That is blue ink. That is a really cool card. So very happy with that break. Very happy with this mail day. Um, let me know in the comments what your favorite card that we got in today's mail is. Um, I'll get some of them laid out here so that you can see them and make your decision. Those are probably the big ones, right? And maybe the I have a lady out of 50. So um, I think pretty much right off the bat, I could tell you which one's my least favorite out of these six, at least. And it's just the kind of plain Jane Ryan Valady from Topps Chrome Sapphire. Like, cool card. But with everything else we got here, we've got an Albert Acetate, like a clear acetate card out of 50. A Cooper Jerpy one of one, a Dean Kremer triple patch auto, um, an Andre Scalaraga auto out of, I think that's triple threads. No, that is tribute. Oh crap, I'm so confused. So I have triple threads and tribute. <laughs> Those are very confusing to me. And the Zach Veen uh, encased auto. So let me know in the comments what your favorite is. If you enjoy this video, make sure to hit the like button and uh, subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any future uh, any future videos. Make sure to check out Getaway Day Pod, uh, our weekly podcast, uh, talking about all of your favorite players and teams. And I will see you back here next time. If you enjoy the podcast, please subscribe on your favorite podcasting app or YouTube to make sure you don't miss any future episodes. Join the conversation on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok at Getaway Day Pod. If you enjoy card collecting, check out our sister YouTube channel at Getaway Day Cards. <laughs>